Previously, we covered the Euclid Space Telescope news and updates and explained how this amazing instrument will help us understand the mysteries of the universe. Today, we have some exciting news to share with you. The Euclid Telescope has just released some of its first images, and they are stunning. These images show us some of the most beautiful and fascinating cosmic structures, from nebulae and galaxies to clusters and lenses. They also reveal some of the secrets of dark matter and dark energy, the invisible forces that shape our universe. In this video, we will take a closer look at these images and explain what they mean and why they are so important. We will focus on three images, the Horsehead Nebula, the Hidden Galaxy, and the Perseus Cluster. These images will demonstrate the power and potential of the Euclid Telescope to answer some of the fundamental questions about the origin, evolution, and fate of the universe. So, are you ready to embark on this cosmic journey with me? Let's go. The first image I want to show you is this one. Do you see that dark shape that looks like a horse's head? That's the Horsehead Nebula, a dark cloud of gas and dust that is located about 1,500 light years away from Earth in the constellation of Orion. This image was taken by the Euclid Telescope using its visible and near-infrared camera, which can capture light from a wide range of wavelengths. The image shows the Horsehead Nebula in full color, revealing its intricate structure and texture. The red and orange colors indicate the presence of hydrogen gas, which is ionized by the radiation from a nearby star. The blue and green colors indicate the presence of dust, which reflects the starlight. The dark region in the center is the horse's head, which is a dense cloud of gas and dust that blocks the light from behind. This image is important because it shows how the Euclid telescope can capture the details and diversity of the cosmic structures that are shaped by the interplay of matter and radiation. It also tells us about the formation and evolution of stars and planets, which are born from the collapse of gas and dust clouds like the Horsehead Nebula. In fact, if you look closely, you can see some faint dots that are young stars forming inside the nebula. These stars are still surrounded by their protoplanetary disks, which are the seeds of future planetary systems. This can help us understand how these disks evolve and how they interact with the environment. For example, how do they survive the harsh radiation from the nearby star? How do they form planets and moons? How do they influence the chemistry and biology of life? These are some of the questions that the Euclid Telescope can help us answer by studying the Horsehead Nebula and other similar regions in the galaxy. But the Horsehead Nebula is not the only fascinating image that the Euclid Telescope has captured. There is another one that is even more surprising and intriguing. It is the image of the Hidden Galaxy, a spiral galaxy that is partially obscured by a foreground galaxy. How can the Euclid Telescope see through the foreground galaxy and reveal the hidden one behind it? And what does this image tell us about the invisible substance that makes up most of the mass of the universe? Let's find out in the next section. Do you see that bright blob that covers part of the image? That's a foreground galaxy, a galaxy that is closer to us than the one behind it. And do you see that faint spiral shape that is peeking through the blob? That's the hidden galaxy, a galaxy that is behind the foreground galaxy and is partially obscured by it. The hidden galaxy is located about 44 million light years away from Earth in the constellation of Leo. This image was taken by the Euclid telescope using its visible and near-infrared camera. The image shows the hidden galaxy in full color, revealing its spiral arms and central bulge. But how can the Euclid telescope see through the foreground galaxy and reveal the hidden one behind it? The answer is gravitational lensing, a phenomenon that occurs when the gravity of a massive object bends the light from another object behind it. The foreground galaxy acts as a lens that magnifies and distorts the image of the hidden galaxy behind it. This is similar to how a magnifying glass can enlarge and deform the image of an object behind it. The Euclid telescope can use gravitational lensing to see the hidden parts of the universe that are otherwise inaccessible to us. This image is important because it shows how the Euclid telescope can use gravitational lensing to study the distribution and behavior of dark matter, the invisible substance that makes up most of the mass of the universe and causes gravitational lensing. 
By measuring the amount and shape of the distortion caused by the foreground galaxy, we can infer the amount and shape of the dark matter around it. And by comparing the images of the hidden galaxy with and without the lensing effect, we can also infer the properties of the dark matter in the hidden galaxy itself. For example, how much dark matter is there in the galaxy? How is it distributed among the stars and gas? How does it affect the formation and evolution of the galaxy? Another fascinating image that Euclid Telescope has captured is one that is even more spectacular and impressive. It is the image of the Perseus Cluster, a massive cluster of galaxies that is one of the brightest sources of X-rays in the sky. How can the Euclid Telescope combine different types of light to create a comprehensive picture of the cosmic phenomena that are beyond our human vision? And what does this image tell us about the mysterious force that is driving the accelerated expansion of the universe? Let's find out in the next section. Do you see that colorful blob that fills the image? That's the Perseus Cluster, a massive cluster of galaxies that is located about 240 million light years away from Earth in the constellation of Perseus. This image was taken by the Euclid Telescope using its visible and near-infrared camera. The image shows the Perseus Cluster in full color, revealing its hundreds of galaxies and the hot gas that fills the space between them. The red and yellow colors indicate the presence of X-rays, which are emitted by the gas as it is heated to millions of degrees by the gravitational attraction of the cluster. The blue and green colors indicate the presence of optical and infrared light, which are emitted by the stars and dust in the galaxies. This image is important because it shows how the Euclid telescope can combine different types of light to create a comprehensive picture of the cosmic phenomena that are beyond our human vision. It also tells us about the role and nature of dark energy the mysterious force that is driving the accelerated expansion of the universe. By measuring the distance and velocity of the galaxies in the cluster, we can estimate the amount and effect of dark energy on the evolution of the universe. For example, how fast is the universe expanding? How has the expansion rate changed over time? How does dark energy affect the growth and structure of the clusters? These are some of the questions that the Euclid telescope can help us answer by studying the Perseus cluster and other similar objects in the universe. These images demonstrate the power and potential of the Euclid telescope to capture the beauty and complexity of the cosmos and to answer some of the fundamental questions about the origin, evolution, and fate of the universe. I hope you enjoyed this cosmic journey with me and that you learned something new and exciting. As Carl Sagan said, somewhere, something incredible is waiting to be known. Let's join the Euclid mission in its quest to discover the incredible secrets of the universe. Thank you for watching and see you next time.